Hello everybody, this is Katerina. Welcome to my Katya Beauty Style channel. And today I want to say thank you, thank you very much for watching my video, sharing my video, also message me and follow me on Instagram and Facebook. Again, my channel it's Katya Beauty Style. I'm here for you to show you, to help you how to look pretty, sexy and I hope you are I'm bringing you little happiness or oh, big happiness because I do this because it's make me very very happy and today I am showing you top is the top is brand which one we carry at Nordstrom and it's Chanel I have uh, on me beautiful foundation and it's a Vitalumer foundation I usually not really switching my foundation but I think you should try because this foundation looks amazing on me and this is beautiful eyeshadow it's uh, incredible 274 and its name godness elegant beautiful gold eyeshadow again let me come to my camera much more close check it out it's amazing amazing and first five people who will message me on instagram message just like mascara chanel mascara will receive from me sample chanel mascara and samples of chanel lash primer again five first people who message me on instagram i will send you home this two sample and maybe i will add something else just message me and i will send you home free shipping let's start this video again love you all I want you to be happy because I'm so happy you with me. I received so many messages for Christmas and for New Year's. Love you all and I'm with you girls. My first step, I'm gonna use White Lumer foundation. This is its foundation has 15 SPF and it's a moisture rich radiance foundation. What I like about this foundation and my skin usually oily to combinational but winter time my actually skin feels a little bit dry it is medium coverage but i like how it sits on my skin if you're looking for natural finish foundation this is it will be your foundation my second step i'm gonna use chanel la correct alone wearing concealer and we're gonna apply like big letter V and I'm gonna blend concealer with my beauty sponge now I'm gonna put a little bit my concealer in front of my nose a little bit right here and a little bit right here just to bright this area and I'm blending this with my beauty blender. Also, because I have a little bit melasma here, this concealer will cover all my melasma. It looks great. I actually really like this foundation. It's give me, I'm serious, it looks so natural and healthy on my skin. I have foundation on my skin. Now I also have a concealer and foundation. It's number 20 clear and my concealer number 20 beige. And now I'm gonna use finishing powder and it's a healthy glow sheer powder with a Chanel brushes powder brush. Uh, I actually really like Chanel brushes they so beautiful and they have a good good quality 
and if you want your foundation to stay all day you need to use powder for my contour for my bronze i'm gonna use same same um powder but darker color this is i use for entire my face and this color it's number 40 um i'm gonna use is my bronze and I'm using, it's a um, contour brush from Chanel again. It's so pretty and I like this angle from my ear to my lips. And I apply like very, very like trying to apply very soft way. And then first I'm gonna just put close to my hairline and try to, when you apply and go up. Also, I'm gonna apply bronze under to a little bit slim. <laughs> I have bronze in my skin face, and if you ever see harsh line, get your big powder brush and just go all over because you never know. Like sometimes you can put a little bit less on one side and another. This is why I like to go one time all over with my big, big powder brush from Chanel. Next step, I'm gonna use number 10 Ivory Golo uh, Powder Lumer. It's a highlighter and I like this to use highlighter sometimes on my eyes, just like an eyeshadow or I will put right here on my cheekbone little bit on my nose above my lips very little but i'll tell you i really really like how this foundation looks it looks amazing on me wow if your skin is normal to dry it's perfect okay little bit i using same contouring brush very very little i apply in this uh, illuminating powder to give me this sexy glow very little on my nose very very little and now i'm gonna put above my lips for my blush, I'm gonna use one of most popular color from Chanel. It's Rose Petal number 99. It's it's one of the most popular color from Chanel. I feel like it's anyone can use it's so soft and it's so pretty but you can build if you want looks much more darker you can layer and layer and build this uh, blush to color which one you intensity which one you like it smiling a little bit right here it's my cheek don't go like right here just go uh, like halfway and apply up for extra lift. For my lips, I'm gonna use Chanel lip liner and it's number 156. It's a very, very neutral, neutral color. And for my lipstick, I'm gonna use number 432 and it's formula Rouge Coco. It's I know my lips always looks or I looks better in a neutral nude color. This is this is color will be perfect for me. Natural beige lip line already on my lips. It's so pretty. And now let's do lipstick. Wow, this lip color looks beautiful. Let me nod on. Uh, if you look at this color, it looks more like orangey, but it's uh, on my lips. It looks much more nude pink. And now I'm gonna use this beautiful gold eyeshadow palette from Chanel, and it's number. 274 again if you like all these products please reach me i can send you home it's free shipping and of course i'm gonna put some nice beautiful presents for you from nordstrom i'm gonna use first brush and it's chanel brush definer smudge it's a double ending brush and i really like because we have smaller brushes and bigger brushes we're gonna start with darker color and i'm gonna use this small brush first i have already eyeshadow primer on on my eyelid because I want my eyeshadow stay all day long and we started with darker color 
also I'm gonna lift my eye a little bit. Get involved! <laughs> Again, I apply a small brush, darker color close to my eyelashes. Also, I have a little bit left over this darker color and I'm going to use this color uh, bottom my lashes. Where's my bottom lash? Now, one more time, I'm going to add it more this darker color. Now, I'm going to use another brush and this is, it's again, double-ended brush. I like it to have these cups. When you travel, it's perfect to have in, on this side you have concealer brush or you can use for cream eyeshadow or you can use uh, for so many different things and here on another end we have a blending brush right now I'm gonna blend my darker colors I blend my darker eyeshadow and it looks beautiful and even and not too dark Next step, which one I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use right now this lighter color. <laughs> For lighter color, I'm gonna use this, again, definer smudge brush. We use first this small mm, brush for darker color, but now we're gonna use this brush on another end. It's really, really shimmer, very, very shimmer eyeshadow. Third step, I'm gonna use bright gold and I'm gonna use again my double brush, which are blender and concealer. And I'm gonna use this concealer brush for this gold, gold eyeshadow. It's so beautiful gold eyeshadow. I apply on center my eyes, this beautiful gold eyeshadow. Then I'm gonna turn my brush where I have a gold lighter eyeshadow. I'm gonna turn and I'm gonna use this darker gold eyeshadow on another side. And this darker color I'm gonna apply right here and I am connecting with my darker eyeshadow. So pretty. Now this darker eyeshadow, gold darker eyeshadow, I'm gonna put on the bottom, kind of on center. For extra pop. Now I'm gonna use my big blending brush and I'm gonna use this lighter color. Very, very little. We don't need to put too much. And I'm gonna apply close to my eyebrows. very very softly now this brush blending brush have a little bit lighter eyeshadow i like to use my little t-shirt and i'm just gonna clean a little bit and i'm gonna use again this little darker eyeshadow and i'm gonna go on my crease Eyeshadow looks beautiful, gold and shimmer. And I like we use shimmer right here and right here, but on center for middle color, this darker color, it don't have shimmer and it's not looks tacky or like it's showing much my lines and wrinkles. For extra pop, I'm gonna use this beautiful bright blue liquid eyeliner 526 from Chanel. I absolutely in love with this liquid eyeliner all, all what I notice about, about this products you need to apply not one time you need to reapply two or three times to build more intensity and it's coming like brown black blue and beautiful purple color eyeliner I just press 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 to my lash liner I don't know, can you see or not how beautiful this bright blue? 
and eyeshadow looks amazing. I like my eyeliner really bright and intense. I'm gonna apply second layer. Oh my God, I love this liquid eyeliner. You must have this. My eyes, it's almost done. I'm gonna use right now primer uh, for my lashes from Chanel and Chanel mascara. It's so hard to always pronounce for me about this mascara, amenable, intense black mascara. And remember, if you're watching this video, please message me on Instagram and first five people if you live in united states sorry my international friends you will receive from me sample uh, chanel primer and chanel Le volume mascara again five people message me on my instagram and i will send you home <laughs> this mascara i really like it's a good separation lengthening curling never clumps and it's a pretty nice volume if you want to dramatic dramatic you just need to reapply but what i like it as much you many times as much you reapply it never clumps and of course we need to use this mascara on the bottom okay i done my eyelashes they looks amazing i do like my eyeshadow the, it's so pretty shimmer but I I not much usually use colors like this but I think they looks amazing on me I know they will look beautiful amazing on you thank you again for watching my youtube channel i love you follow me and it's gonna come more and more presents from me because it's make me happy and i hope it's gonna make you happy